DS3000H IVAWT wind turbines are a breakthrough in wind energy technology. Unlike traditional wind turbines, these vertical axis wind turbines are highly efficient even in low winds. The DS3000H IVAWT powerful wind turbines for home will outbeats PV solar panels in 2024. Yes, you heard me right. These are vertical axis wind turbines that can generate more power than solar panels, even in low wind conditions, and they look super cool too. Don't believe me? Well, stick around and I'll show you why these wind turbines are the future of renewable energy. So, what are these wind turbines? Well, they are made by a company called HIVWT, which stands for High Performance Vertical Axis Small Wind Turbines. They have won several awards and certifications for their innovative design and performance. The DS3000 is their largest model, with a rated power of 3 kilowatts and a rotor diameter of 4 meters. It can produce up to 2,460 kilowatt hours per year, which is enough to power an average household in USA. But what makes these wind turbines so special? Well, there are several advantages of using vertical axis wind turbines over horizontal axis ones. First of all, they can capture wind from any direction without needing to adjust their orientation. This means they can work well in urban areas where the wind direction is often changing due to buildings and other obstacles. Second, they can operate at lower wind speeds, as low as 3 meters per second, which makes them suitable for places where the wind is not very strong or consistent. Third, they have a lower noise level, only 42.3 decibels a, eh, which is comparable to a quiet conversation. This means they won't disturb your neighbors or wildlife. Fourth, they have a lower visual impact, as they are shorter and more compact than horizontal axis wind turbines. They can also be installed on rooftops or other structures, saving space and reducing installation costs. So, how do these wind turbines compare to solar panels? Well, let's take a look at some numbers. According to CNET, the average cost of solar panels in USA is about $2.65 per watt, which means a 3 kilowatt system would cost about $7,950 before incentives. The average annual energy production of such a system would depend on the location and the orientation of the panels, but let's assume it's about 3,600 kilowatt hours per year, which is slightly higher than the national average. Now, according to HIVA Doduki, the cost of the DS3000 wind turbine is about $6,000. The average annual energy production of this wind turbine is 2,000. 460 kilowatt hours per year, as we mentioned before. So if we compare these two systems based on their cost and output, we can see that the wind turbine has a lower cost per watt, $2.50 is $2.65, and a higher output per dollar, 0.328 kilowatt hours is 0.453 kilowatt hours. This means that the wind turbine can pay for itself faster than the solar panels and generate more savings over time. But wait, there's more. There are other factors that make the wind turbine even more attractive than the solar panels. For example, the wind turbine has a longer warranty period, 10 years for the generator and 5 years for the blades, compared to 10 years for the solar panels. This means that the wind turbine is more durable and reliable than the solar panels and requires less maintenance and replacement costs. Also, the wind turbine can produce power at night or during cloudy days, when the solar panels cannot. This means that the wind turbine can provide more consistent and stable power than the solar panels and reduce the need for battery storage or grid backup. So, how do these wind turbines look like? Well, they are pretty sleek and stylish, if you ask me. They have a cylindrical shape, with three curved blades that rotate around a central axis. They come in different colors, such as white, black, red, blue, or green. You can choose the color that matches your house or your preference. But how do these wind turbines work? Well, it's pretty simple. The wind blows on the blades, causing them to spin around the axis. The spinning motion creates a torque, 
which is transferred to a generator through a gearbox. The generator converts the mechanical energy into electrical energy, which can be used to power your appliances or stored in batteries. The wind turbine also has a controller, which monitors the wind speed and direction, and adjusts the blade angle and rotation speed accordingly. The controller also connects to a smart meter, which displays the power output and consumption of the wind turbine. You can access the smart meter through an app on your phone or computer and check the status and performance of your wind turbine anytime and anywhere. Now let's answer some frequently asked questions about these wind turbines. The first question is, how much space do I need to install these wind turbines? Well, not much at all. The DS3000 wind turbine has a rotor diameter of 4 meters and a height of 3 meters. This means that you only need a space of 4 by 4 by 3 meters to install it. That's about the size of a small car. You can easily fit it on your rooftop or backyard, or even on your balcony or terrace. The installation process is also very easy and fast. You just need to mount the wind turbine on a pole or a frame, connect it to the grid or batteries, and you're good to go. The second question is, how much noise do these wind turbines make? Well, not much at all either. As I mentioned before, these wind turbines have a low noise level of only 42.3 decibels a, eh, which is comparable to a quiet conversation. You won't hear any annoying whirring or humming sounds from these wind turbines. They are very quiet and peaceful. You can enjoy the breeze without any disturbance. So how do you choose the best location and size for your wind turbine? Well, there are a few things you need to consider. First, you need to check the wind resource in your area. You can use a wind map, such as this one, to see the average wind speed and direction in your location. You want to choose a place that has a high and steady wind speed, preferably above 5 meters per second. You also want to avoid any obstacles that may block or divert the wind, such as trees, buildings, or hills. Second, you need to check the zoning and permitting regulations in your area. You need to make sure that you are allowed to install a wind turbine on your property and that you comply with any height, noise, or safety restrictions. You may need to obtain a permit or approval from your local authorities before you proceed with the installation. You can contact your municipality or utility company for more information on the rules and requirements in your area. That's it for this video. I hope you learned something new and useful about the DS3000 high watt wind turbines for home that outbeats PV solar panels in 2024. These are truly amazing devices that can help you save money, protect the environment, and enjoy the power of the wind. If you have any questions or comments about these wind turbines, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I'll try to answer them as soon as possible. You can also follow me on social media for more updates and content on green and sustainable topics. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. It really helps me out a lot. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.